depending on your age or how many old books you've read, you might be familiar with the fact that castor oil used to be used as a laxative. And so there's a lot of fear around any other use for castor oil except something not particularly pleasant. And you could still use it as a laxative. Two tablespoons for an adult will definitely get you to the bathroom pretty quick. But there's lots of other uses for castor oil and now top hairdressers are using it for hair to stimulate the scalp, to stimulate hair growth, to make the colour of the hair richer. And you can do that at home. You can heat a couple of tablespoons of castor oil with a couple of tablespoons of coconut oil, heat that up over a bain-marie, which is a glass bowl over some water, and massage that into your scalp. Stops any kind of itchy scalp and also really stimulates hair growth, making your hair richer, thicker, better. But you need to wash it out a couple of times. So you're washing it, you're kind of massaging it all the way down the hair shaft but don't leave it in too long unless uh, you really need a deep conditioning treatment. And then when you wash it out, do it really well because it does leave a bit of a residue. So castor oil is very thick and unctuous and it usually needs diluting with something else and doesn't smell that great. But it can be used as a massage oil. So again, mix it up with something like coconut oil, add a few drops of aromatherapy oil in there and you've got yourself something really great because it penetrates the skin and also really helps with lymphatic drainage and blood supply to the skin itself. So it has loads of really great quality and qualities and properties and it's super cheap. So it also has other uses, it's an antifungal, so you can use it for things um, like when you've got fungal infections between your toes or what has been termed as jock itch or ringworm, it's really effective for things like that. Also really helps with sleep. There's been lots of studies done that if people massage it on their temples or even put a drop on each eyelid that they have a much, much deeper sleep. I think it has a multitude of purposes and uses and you can Google some of those on the internet. But it's also really rich in omega-3, omega-6 and vitamin E, which of course we find in a lot of beauty products and skin products anyway. So it's a little bit of a home hack. Cheap as chips, use it for everything. Uh, dilute it out and make it smell better because it's not that great. But we'd love to hear other ideas for uses of castor oil as opposed to just the laxative. So if you'd like to message us, we'd love to hear from you. Subscribe below and have a healthy week.